The next knot we're going to tie is a figure eight follow through. In order to tie the figure eight follow through, I'm going to grab about halfway down my rope, ensuring I have enough to tie my follow through and to go around my anchor point. To tie the figure eight follow through, I'm going to cross over the top of the rope with my working end. Going under the working end and then through the bite. I don't want to dress and load this entirely because I need to go around my anchor or through my eyelet in order to finish tying this knot. I'm going to take my working end and railroad track all the way through the figure eight stopper knot. Ensuring the rope stays flat and parallel all the way around, following the exact position of that other rope. When I get to the other side, I will pull on both ends slightly to ensure that there's no twists, bends, or X's. To finalize dressing this knot, I need to pop each collar to one side or the other, then dressing and loading the knot individually. Pulling on opposite ends to ensure the knot tightens all the way through. Making sure there's no twists, cross, or bends anywhere in my figure eight. My tail length must be between two and 10 inches, and the bite size does not matter as long as it can go around my anchor point.